Hello everyone and welcome back to Virtual Cheese Emporium. Yay! Nice to see you guys. <laughs> As you saw from the title, I am currently going back to college for the spring semester. And I am currently sitting in my bed and it is 11.40 in night, in the p.m. 11.40 at night. And it's the day before I have to go back to school. Fun! Yay! <laughs> so, yeah, I'm going to be guiding you through, well, the next day when I have to go to school and the day after that because they're both different school days. That way you can see what I go through when I go to college. Yay! Sounds fun! I'm also going to be giving giving you guys a little, like, night routine sort of thing. I'm going to, like, expand on that in another video, which will be posted in January. But I'm going to give you, like, a little mini snapshot into getting ready for bed. And then I'm going to go through the whole day getting ready for school, being at school, and showing you all my college life. Glamorous stuff, I know. <laughs> so, yeah, let's get this show on the road and go to bed before we actually go to school in the morning. Sorry, no night routine clips. Just enjoy this little video of me in the shower bun and a very discolored, you know, tint to the video. Sorry again. Good morning, everybody. It is currently around 7 or 7.30 in the morning. And as you will see in a few seconds, I look quite exhausted. My alarm was actually set for later, but here I am now. So, after some computer work, I get up at 7.45, put on these adorable blue unicorn slippers, and begin to start my day. Ah yes, the bathroom. The place in the morning where everything can go completely right or completely wrong. It all depends on the situation. So, after you brush your teeth, preferably two times, I wash my face with CeraVe Cleanser, which makes your face super soft and super moisturized. I highly recommend it to anyone with sensitive skin. It will do wonders for your face. Oh, and also make sure to use a towel. Your hands don't work. Make sure that your towel has some friction but is still soft, like this baby towel that I'm using. And after washing the face and brushing the teeth, it's makeup time. I'm gonna make this quick because I don't wanna draw out this video too much. And here we are, super pretty and super purple. And now for the outfit of the day, a sophisticated white button down and an adorable purple skirt with some white stockings. What could go wrong? Whoops, forgot a few things. You can't forget about those adorable purple flats, and of course, the jewelry that I'm going to wear along with it. There, that's better. Turns out, I don't like my outfit too much. Even fashion geniuses can be wrong on occasion. But before I can fix it, we gotta have some breakfast, courtesy of Chipotle. Now we can start fixing the outfit. We have this adorable turtleneck with some really cute flowers on it. All I gotta do is iron it up, and there I am. And in a few more seconds, you shall see that I also changed my earrings too. Gotta give a bit more of a dramatic flair to my first day of school outfit, of course. Driving to school, driving to school. This is just gonna be a montage of, you know, the road and all that stuff. Won't take too long. And here we are on our lovely, illustrious college campus. And there's the name right there, if you can read it. But yep, here we are, giant expansive campus, really nice theater program, really good science building, and all for me. Let's go to class, everybody. Only had one class today, and of course, I wasn't allowed to film it. So here we are, time skip to the bus stop. Hey 
guys. So it's the end of class and I hope you can hear me. <laughs> so I'm at the bus stop right now and I'm just waiting for my bus so I can get home. Oh yeah, by the way, I only have one class in person on Mondays and Wednesdays. So I get to go home and work on my stuff and it's really nice. Yep, so I'm just waiting at the bus and freezing right now. <laughs> See you. Yep, there we go. <laughs> I am home, my darlings. Ha ha ha. Yay. <laughs> Hello. So you must be wondering what I do now that I'm home and I have technically no more school. Well, first of all, a nap. I need a nap. I could not sleep on the bus or else I'd miss my stop, so nap. And then I'm gonna work on my distance learning classes. Super fun, yay! And then I'm going to probably go to sleep for a little bit more before drawing, writing, and doing some more stuff. So first, nap time, okay? Later. <laughs> so that nap went on a little longer than I would have liked, so here's a tiny speed run. As you can see, I ate some lunch. I am reading this very thick English textbook about practical argument and how to read and write and all that jazz. And Ah, I missed my place. Oh yeah, then I did some video editing. I see it on the screen now. That took such a long time. And then we went to the ballet store because I'm taking a ballet class in college. I'm taking it the next day after this video. And I got myself leotard tights. I already have shoes, but you know, more shoes, because that always helps. And I got dressed for theater rehearsal tonight. We're doing a choreography rehearsal, so more relaxed clothing instead of my adorable skirt and stockings. After a quick change of earrings, we are ready to go to our ominously lit campus. As you saw earlier in the video, it's a lot brighter and more inviting during the day. But yeah, walking across it during like, you know, winter evenings, not a very pleasant sight to see, but it's what I have to do. All right, rehearsal for the musical is over and it's time to head home. Well, first we gotta get a pit stop for some food. Line better not be insane. Well, I don't see cars going around the block, so let us hope. I'm trying to get fries from Wendy's, that's why. We're driving here. Yay! It's free. Ah. Nothing like a hot bag of Wendy's fries to refuel you after a long night of singing, dancing, and acting. And as you can tell, I enjoyed those fries immensely. And just like that, I am home once again and I have to go and do my computer work. Fun stuff. But we are going to do it because if I don't, then I'm going to fail out of college and then I'm going to be very sad and very broke and so will my family. Yay! So yeah, homework and then dinner and then we'll see where the night goes from there. Now we're moving on to some actual night routine stuff. First step for the night, get this makeup off, making my face feel sticky. There we go, that's better. Now we're going to move on to some actual dinner stuff because fries are not going to sustain me. Tonight we have lamb chops, some beans and rice, and some applesauce, along with some sleepy time tea. Guys, I accidentally ate a spicy pepper. It was in the rice and I thought it was innocent. Everything hurts. I've been trying to 
eat some ice, but it's too big and it can't fit in my water glass. Oh, the grape juice helped. <laughs> I just had to drink something acidic, so there we go. I just wanted to report on that. Yay. <laughs> I'm okay now, I think. After the spicy pepper debacle, which was kind of traumatizing, but I am healing from, it is time to work on some drawings. I said I was going to be more creative during the year, during the new year, but, <laughs> and I intend to keep my promises to you. Hi guys, just wanted to share some late night reading material that I'm embarking on before I go to bed. Hopefully you can see it, but it's called The Starless Sea by Erin Morgenstern, author of The Night Circus. I need to finish that book, by the way. It was really good. About pirates and magical books and MacGuffins and secret societies traveling through stories and everything and possibly pirates. Just check it out from my college's library, and I hope it is as good as the reviews say. <laughs> I might as well just put like a thumbs up counter. I've been doing this all day. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I did it like 50 times. If, if I could just put like a counter up there, I'll probably remember to do it. But yeah, thumbs up counter right there. I'm going to count how many times I did the thumbs up in my video and put it at the end of the video. So you can all be amused by that fact. <laughs> I hope that wasn't too awkward for you guys. I got 11 seconds. <laughs> All right, I will see you guys after the workout. All right, everyone, time to wash up and stuff and things before we hit the hay. After, you know, repeating the morning routine of brushing the teeth and washing the face, we're gonna put on this wonderfully green hydrating mask to keep our skin pristine and lovely. We're going to wait for that to set for around 15 minutes with this awesome book and then rinse it off. Whoops, that audio clip was a lot shorter than I thought it would be, so I'm going to repeat it again. So I think I'm putting on the mask now. There we go. And now I have the book. And I believe I'm rinsing it off. I could be wrong, but I will eventually be rinsing it off. And then once I'm done with that, we take our melatonin, which is sleep hormones that help us, you know, go to bed faster because I need sleep and sleep is also very good. <laughs> and then turn off the lights and climb into our soft, comfy bed to sleep for the next day. All right, guys, time to hit the hay. Going to bed now with unicorn pillow and my glasses on because why not <laughs> all right i'll see you guys in the outro <laughs> okay i'm going to go to bed bye bye <laughs> all right and that is it for the day in the life of a college student during covid yay you made it to the end of the video i hope it was entertaining or at least insightful and you know inspired chill vibes and made this whole winter debacle thing just a little bit easier to deal with. Thank you so so much for tuning in to my latest video and I hope that you are all having a wonderful day in school. Even if you don't like school, I hope that you are at least finding the positives in your bad day and are just, you know, having a grand old time at life. Once again, thank you so much for visiting Virtual Cheese Emporium and I hope to see you again soon. I'm off to make more fresh, hot, and amazingly tasting content and I shall see you in the next video. Please drink water, please eat lots of cookies, and I'll see you next time everybody. Bye bye!